Alright, this is how you get your hard drive activity. So you can install a lead or something on it. Um, basically, I don't know if you can see that, but you pull it off just like normal. Uh, be very careful and take the hot glue off. If it takes you a little while, take a little longer. It's worth it. You don't want to mess these pins up. Now, I don't know if you can see this or not, but the uh, fifth hole over from left to right, if you're looking at it as it was connected, um, I found a pin straight up. I had to uh, kind of melt it down there a little bit to find a pin, and I soldered this wire to it. Now, I've got a Hitachi drive. I'm not sure if it's any different or not, but I think it's basically the same on mostly every Xbox. Um, you want to take this wire and get up to your ground side of your lead. You want to um, take the uh, other side of your lead and produce 5 volts to it with a resistor which in some of my other videos you can find different sources for 5 volts um, as I'm modding my Xbox. So uh, That's pretty well how you get your hard drive activity. Fifth hole over, straight up. There'll be a pin cut off, or you might actually have a pin sticking up. Just that way. Make sure when you install this, no matter what, if you're going clear or whatever, make sure you make keep a part of the cover for it because you have to be able to keep this down while it's sitting in here or you will not well it can happen but you I have a lot of problems with my hard drive not wanting to stay connected if this plate is not on there so take that to note if you do any kind of different modding